exploring Turing patterns at atomic scales. Patterns can be found across the entire natural world, from the spots on a leopard's coat to stripes in mineral deposits deep underground. Such motifs are better known as Turing patterns, named after the famous mathematician and codebreaker Alan Turing, who proposed the theory behind them. His theory includes a set of equations that describe how chemical reactions create areas of different concentrations, which give rise to patterns that can be seen with the naked eye. These equations explain how stripes, spots and other Turing patterns arise in numerous areas throughout nature. Turing patterns are often found on large scales, such as the stripes on tropical fish. However, they become much rarer at smaller scales, with very few known examples at microscopic and atomic scales. Several years ago, Aaron Kapitolnik and his colleagues succeeded in depositing an atomic layer of bismuth on a metal surface. In some parts of the bismuth layer, where it was only one atom thick, the team noticed a stripy pattern emerging. On a trip to Paris in 2017, Kapitolnik showed images of the bismuth pattern to Yuki Faseya, a theorist at the University of Electrocommunications in Tokyo, Japan. Faseya told Kapitolnik that the stripes resembled those of an angelfish, and as such, they could be a Turing pattern. Soon after this meeting, Faseya, Kapitolnik, and their collaborators, Benia and Katsuno, began to construct an atomic scale model for the growth of this bismuth layer. Remarkably, the equation they obtained for this process is mathematically equivalent to Turing's equation for the formation of biological patterns. Furthermore, their model based on this equation produced a pattern that was almost identical to the stripes seen in the real material. Faseya explains that the stripe forming process is driven by interactions between the bismuth atoms and the metal surface they are deposited on. As the atoms approach the surface, they are attracted to specific spots in the metal's atomic lattice. The bismuth atoms attempt to deposit themselves on these spots, but then find themselves too close together to form a stable layer. The bismuth layer then buckles, producing a wavy pattern where some atoms are raised, forming stripes, each stripe being about five bismuth atoms wide. The team's atomic scale model predicts this process perfectly, illustrating how robust Turing's original insight was. This result demonstrates that the formation of these stripes at an atomic scale is based on the same mechanism that gives rise to an almost identical pattern found on a species of angelfish. As such, the team found the tiniest Turing pattern ever observed. Using further simulations, Dr. Faseya and his colleagues showed that the striped bismuth layer can heal itself. When the surface of the layer is damaged, it reforms, restoring the original pattern. The researchers also showed that by tuning the reaction conditions as the bismuth layer forms, or by changing the substrate, different types of Turing patterns can be created. This team's work paves the way towards exciting technological advances. Faseya hopes that these tiny Turing patterns could be used as building blocks to fabricate novel electronic devices that exhibit new and exciting properties.